So this Instagram model is really popular. Let's call it A. A is from Ghana. Pop singer, entrepreneur, inspires young women everywhere to work hard and be self-made. One day, she meets this man on a dating app. Let's call him B. B is much older than her, but that's okay. That's what she's looking for. He's financially stable, ready to settle down. B lives in the US, A lives in Ghana. But they decide to give it a shot and start messaging back and forth. Pretty soon, they're having discussions about marriage. And we are going down the hill from now. One day, A contacts B, saying her father farms in Ghana, runs into financial trouble. She asks him for help. He's like, okay, and why is her money? And of course, soon after, she asks again, and again, and again. Over a period of time, he had wired a, a total of $100,000 to help her father's farm. Then, out of nowhere, A gets arrested. Everyone's shocked. She's an influencer, 4 million fans. What happened? Why was she arrested? See, the FBI had been on a trail for a while, suspecting her of romance fraud. They call it pig slaughtering. The pigs, people with money, get slaughtered after love bombing, so they can send them money. Lots of times, people are being scammed, they are not even talking to the opposite sex. She's part of a network that targets older people, conning them for money. There was no struggling farm. She just wanted to fund her lifestyle right from the get-go. Obviously, she didn't tell him who she really is. When arrested, she and her group have stolen over $2 million from people just like A. Develop your social skills. You'll see people like these scammers a mile away before getting into trouble.